So I so the trail should start around about here. Now of course trail is the last person to get into position on a, on any any time the ball's coming up the floor. Because you have to be as far back as the players are. So if the ball handler is coming up, you're behind him. You're coming up with him. Coming up, coming up, coming up. And as the play develops, you're about here. This is where you want to be. You're not too far into the play, you're not out of the play. Now, what do you all think you're responsible for in this position? Say that again? Yes, so you're, you're responsible for this line and anything, anything behind. This is all, the, uh, all trail's responsibility. What else? Yeah, yeah. So all, any ball handling up here is your responsibility as well. Anything else? What else are you responsible for? Yes, you are responsible for two-thirds of the three-point line. So everything from those cones over, this is all your responsibility as well. Anything else? Screens. Screens, yes. So that's, that goes with the matchup. You're responsible for the screens, the ball handling, um, making sure they're in defensive position, five seconds, all of that. So if a shot goes up, or a drive starts out here and goes into the lane, take a few steps, go with the play and close in, so that way you get a better view of what's going on underneath the basket. So if there's a push in the back, if there's a foul that lead couldn't see but you caught, you can make the call from here, so that way you better see it. And also if you make a call, people will believe you instead if you're standing out back towards half court, ready to go the other way, and you make a foul call, no one's gonna believe you. Can I see that? Something that, we, that I think is kind of important for new officials, come here. Is if you're you're inbounding, I know this might seem kind of silly, but if you're inbounding the ball, if I'm inbounding to him, make sure you're on the outside of the player. A lot of times, as a new official, it's going to get super hectic, and you're going to be like, make sure you're on the outside, because then you can open up to all to everything that happens to you, that happens in within the play. That's all I got. You got anything else? You've got mid court, this line. And if lead can't catch an outbounds down that corner or three point in that corner, you mark that. You're always on the same side as the lead. So you have to be aware of that. If the lead shifts position to the other side, you become center. You become here. This one. As soon as the ball turns over to the other team, whether it's a made basket, they steal it, or a violation or anything, you have to get on your horse to get all the way down there because you're the new lead. Okay? So there is no dilly dallying on our trail. You've got to make sure you're hustling. If you don't hustle, you're slowing down your whole crew. So you make sure you're hustling the whole time. And this comes with experience, but a lot of times, you're, uh, I actually do this as I back out of the play, so the shot goes up, and I kind of, ex I kind of, I'm guessing what's going to happen, so I'm backing out. Try and avoid that. Try and stay in the play until you're sure, until someone secures a rebound, and you're sure it's going the other way, and you get back fast. You can also do that slot too. Um, so. Over here, the shot goes up, and you're like, okay, I gotta get back. You can also take a step down.